Meghan Markle jealous of Kate appearance at BAFTA party. The five alterations Kate made to her BAFTA's dress by Alexander McQueen. On Sunday night, Kate Middleton rewore her Alexander McQueen gown from the 2019 BAFTAs, although she made five changes to her overall look. During Sunday night's BAFTA awards, Kate, Princess of Wales, wore a beloved Alexander McQueen gown once again. The Prince and Princess of Wales attended the awards for the first time since 2020 this year. Since 2013, Prince William has presided over BAFTA. There were some adjustments done to the lovely Alexander McQueen dress that Kate was wearing. The 2019 BAFTA Awards served as the debut for the Grecian-inspired dress. However, Kate altered the way her dress looked at the shoulders as well as her jewelry, shoes, gloves, and clutch bag. The dress had its left shoulder altered for the engagement on Sunday night. The extra fabric was added and fastened to the shoulder after the floral petals were taken off. The princess opera-length gloves were the most striking part of her outfit on Sunday night. These gloves were probably made by Cornelia James in the Melissa design, which is oddly enough still available. On the Princess of Wales, they are extremely stylish and lovely and sell for a staggering £160. In their profile, it states, We adore velvet. It is opulently magnificent. Yet, velvet, especially black velvet, contrasts beautifully with satin. Use velvet for your gloves if your dress is a satin fantasy since they will be the ideal contrast. The reviews for the gloves are overwhelmingly positive, with one saying, I adore my Melissa gloves so much. I can't wait to flaunt my latest fashion choice. Excellent craftsmanship, lovely packaging, and outstanding customer service. Thank you everybody. Beth and Holt, a fashion expert, said, Given that this is Catherine's first appearance at the BAFTAs in her role as Princess of Wales, the decision to wear gloves is all the more intriguing. The late Queen Elizabeth rarely left the palace without her distinctive gloves, which are a standard piece of clothing for the royal family to the telegraph, she spoke. The Aquasera Phoenix pumps that Kate wore with her dress were originally spotted at the September 2021 No Time to Die premiere. The princess carried her Jimmy Choo Celeste clutch bag, which was an eye-catching black hue to go with her gloves. Kate donned a fresh pair of cascading flower earrings from Zara, which come with flower-shaped charms and jewel applique. Unsurprisingly, the earrings listed at £17.99 are already sold out. In contrast, the, then, Duchess of Cambridge adorned the dress in 2019 with Diana, Princess of Wales's diamond and pearl earrings. She further carried a McQueen bag, the small crystal embellished clutch, and wore the Queen's diamond caterfoil bracelet. In 2019, she also donned the silver and dusk blue fireball glitter degrade Romy heels from Jimmy Choo. The engagement rings of Meghan and Camilla are remarkably similar and have such a nice message. The diamond engagement rings worn by Meghan Markle and Queen Camilla are remarkably similar. Both Queen Camilla and Meghan Markle are wearing gorgeous diamond engagement rings. Express. Co. UK received an exclusive interview with Jeremy Hines, director of jewellery specialist Seth Hines, who discussed both diamonds and pointed out an intriguing likeness between them. Gorgeous engagement ring for Meghan Markle with one enormous diamond and two smaller diamonds on either side. According to Jeremy, Prince Harry actually created Meghan's stunning yellow gold diamond trilogy ring himself over the course of six months, and what a fantastic job he did. This is in keeping with true royal tradition, Jeremy said to Express. Co. UK. He asserted that non-royal proposals have since been influenced by the royal engagement ring. The specialist stated trilogy rings have returned to the spotlight since the engagement, and we hope that trend will continue because they have such a sweet significance. Three distinct stones, found only in trilogy rings, stand for something quite special, the past, the present, and the future. Very lovely, for Meghan's engagement ring, Harry picked out three ideal diamonds and opted to set them on a conventional yellow gold band, which really makes those huge diamonds stand out. The ring is loaded with sentimental value and is estimated to be worth about £120,000 by the professionals at Stephen Stone. After the passing of his mother, Prince Harry travelled to Botswana, where the centre diamond was found. Five days into their relationship, Harry and Meghan went on their third date in Botswana while he was on an African conservation mission.